Wild Time Cooking with Allison Davis is brought to you by Corman Kitchen and Bath. Welcome back to Midday Kentucky. Chef Allison Davis here in the Wild Time Kitchen. And i got a friend with me today. I've got uh, Den Captain Dennis Dickman from the Scott County Fire Department. And we're talking uh, chicken wings. And you all may or may not know, there's a big game coming up, right? Um, and chicken wings are like the number one food. Chicken wings, pizza, and chili, I think, are the top three. It's my favorite appetizer. Right? And you even said that you guys have made wings at the firehouse plenty of times, yes, right? Yes, we do. We use it in the air fryer. Yeah, yeah. which is what we're doing. We're going to be doing the air fryer today. And this is, uh, we're going to talk about two different ways. So one we already did and we already kind of have ready to go. Um, you made a dry rub, right? Yeah, I made a dry rub out of some basic ingredients. Uh, got a little bit of salt and then we do uh, pepper and then we add uh, cayenne pepper. As much as, much or as little as you like. <laughs> right. Uh, for those who like it hot, you want more cayenne pepper. And of course we add paprika, onion powder, and garlic powder. Perfect. All right, and then so you could do strictly just a dry rub. So some people don't want to add any extra fat because with the air fryer and with chicken wings, you can actually get enough fat just out of the chicken wings themselves. Um, but what we're going to do is kind of do a little buffalo version, right? So I've got a little bit of melted butter here that we're just going to kind of pour on our wings. And then we're just going to take some Frank's hot sauce. Everybody loves Frank's, right? All right little Frank's hot sauce. Now what I want you to do is give me some of your dry rub. So we're going to kind of make our own version here. And then we're just going to toss this in this sauce just to kind of coat it. All right. And then so show them the rack. And yours at home, we're actually neighbors. So yours at home has a basket, right? It has a basket. And this is just a flat rack here. Right. So some of them are different where this one's got like several levels. And so it goes on a rack. But you, in your house, you just put them in the basket and just slide them in, yes. right? Yes. Mm -hmm. yep. Okay. So then we'll just take these and just kind of lay them around. I like to have them spread out a little bit, right? You don't want to overcrowd You want to make them. sure the air circulates around all the wings. Perfect. Um, and then let me just kind of top that a little bit. All right. And then you're just going to go in your air fryer. Now mine, I don't know about yours, but mine has like a chicken setting, right? Like it has a little chicken. Put it up top. There you go. Perfect. So you can kind of see it has like a chicken wing, right? Does yours yep. have a chicken setting? It has setting? a chicken wing. Make sure it's about 400 degrees. We try we to go. We have found as well, like we like to turn our temp up to about 400. It should be set on, you know, maybe like 20 minutes max. Then you can always check it if you need to. You can turn them around and then you just turn it on and you let it go. There's nothing else that you have to do, right? That's itself. All right, so then magic of TV. These were in the air fryer, again, like you said, 400 for 20 minutes. And this one was the dry rub. So just like get in there and uh, let's see what we got working. So we got dry rub here Tell with some cayenne. Tell your camera guys, pretty upset cayenne. right now. And you can just see like it gets nice and nice and crispy and it's just, mm, it's money. Perfect it's for the game, spicy. serve with a little blue cheese ranch and you're good to go. You want to say anything to the guys over at the firehouse? I want to give a shout out to Scott County Fire Department Station 1, second shift. We're going to make this after the big game, before the big game, and hopefully we don't burn you out with all this spice. <laughs> it's got it's a little pretty cayenne hot. <laughs> in it. It's hot. All right, guys, we'll put this dry rub recipe up and the buffalo sauce at middaykentucky.com forward slash recipes. I'm Chef Allison Davis. Thanks, Captain Dickman, for coming in. Thanks for having me. And uh, we'll be right back after this short break. <laughs> 